Hi everyone. So today is October 3rd and I'm at mile 6,184 plus 127. So right now we are going to go head up to this place called the Kessner Homestead. And this is a 1.3 mile loop. And with what we walked the other day, I'll be at mile 6,186 plus 129. Thanks to Cora adding on two more miles. Um, I want to say thank you so much for inviting me into your home and and show me all these amazing places. Yeah, no problem. So there's two trails that we could do. There's this, it's a Maple Glade Loop. It's a half a mile loop. Or starting here, which is where we are, going all the way up to the Kessner Higley Homestead and doing a 1.3 mile loop. And the trail that we're gonna be on is Kessner Homestead. Take a trip back through time along this general 1.3 mile loop trail to visit the original Kessner Homestead of 1891 purchased by the Higley family around 1946. This historic area was occupied for nearly 100 years. Today, the buildings are restored to give us a glimpse of what life was like for these early European homesteaders in the Quinault Valley. Although you cannot enter the house, take a peek inside the original smokehouse and root house. The new barn roof shelters picnic tables for your use. The only restroom is here at the ranger station. And we are in bear and cougar country, so, I'll consider myself pretty lucky if we see one or both of them. <laughs> All right, let's get this adventure started, y'all. Wow, this is so freaking beautiful. Uh, just right off the bat. This is pretty freaking magnificent. That's pretty amazing tree. I think. I don't know. Oh, no. This would be like, I guess, the kitchen. I honestly don't know, guys. I honestly don't know. But I could see how that'd be like an oven or whatnot. And that'd be the cauldron. This is the covered barn. It's pretty amazing.
place. Wow, wow, that was pretty freaking beautiful. That was pretty freaking beautiful. <laughs> Wasn't that amazing? It was so freaking beautiful. So now I'm at mile 6,186 plus 129, thanks to Cora adding on two more miles. And now we are on our way to the spot called Ruby Beach. Um, she says it's pretty magical, so let's go see. But first, um, we stopped so she can hit the bathroom here and I'm gonna check out this awesome view of Lake Quinault. Right on. Wow. Look at how massive. Yeah. Okay, that's about as far out as I can go comfortably. Yeah. Yep. Now I gotta turn around. <sighs> Fuck. Uh, yeah, I hate heights. And I don't care that that's only like a foot or two down. My eyesight's like, my eyes are saying nope. Oh, fuck. I hate this. Yeah, no. Just focus on what's right in front of me. So there's that view. There's that view. All right, on I go. Me and my fear of heights and balance being all fucked off a bit. Hunk a duck. Wow. Wow. That's so beautiful. This is just, this is all just so freaking beautiful.
Wow, that was so fucking awesome. That was so awesome. That was so freaking beautiful. Just wow, wow. But uh, me and my fear of heights. <sighs> some days, some days I can battle it really good. Other days, like today, nope, nope. <sighs> and on we go for more magic. Now off to Ruby Beach. Always, guys, it's your hit. Don't make me smoke all this weed by myself. Find me, follow me, see where I am. I challenge you to come out and walk one mile with me, and I will show you magic. And this is the inside of this magnificent tree, y'all. And there's the view out. Fuck yeah, it's your hit. Much love and much peace, you all. beautiful and that tree um i wasn't expecting to find a tree to sleep in her <laughs> sleep yeah yeah that's where my brain's at i want to sleep in that fucker